What's going on everybody? It's Patman Trucking here with another video. Um, I just wanted to come in and give a little update about what's been going on. Um, so far, in this owner-operator experience that I've had, it has been going, for the most part, pretty good. Um, don't mind my hair. It's a little crazy. Um, I've been driving all day. Um, but... It's been pretty good. I uh, can't complain. Um, I'm making, you know, decent money with me going home a lot. You know, I got two kids at the house. So, I mean, I ain't making as much as mothers, and, I, and I'm not making as least as others. I'm like, I'm, I'm okay. Let's just put it that way. I'm okay. My bills are paid. I'm doing good. Got money in the bank. Um, like, I love it, man. Uh, being my own balls, doing my own thing. It's great so far. I mean, yeah, there's a lot of downsides to it. Um, but, I mean, like last week, I mean, I only brought home 800 bucks to my pocket after all my bills and expenses are paid. But I was home five days. I was home five days and still brought that home in my pocket so I mean I can stay out and you know be gone for months at a time which people do that's fine that's all up to y'all and y'all's preferences on running y'all's business that's the thing it's y'all's business not anybody else's don't let nobody tell you what you should and shouldn't do uh, what you need to make and what you don't need to make you make what you need to make to pay the bills and keep money in your pocket that's all that matters um, but you know I've had you know, good paychecks and bad paychecks in this past three months. Um, I'll eventually go over all that. I just want to get a good, um, what should I say, rhythm going before I start releasing all that stuff. Talking about that, I just want to get a good flow going and make sure I'm doing everything great. Um, but, you know, can't complain so far. Uh, it's been it's been rough, but it's been good too, man. Nobody telling me what to do. Nobody breathing down my back. Nobody telling me where I have to and where I I, I need to go, where I can't go. I'm going anywhere in the fucking United States I want. So it's great, man. Uh, you know, some downsides is you know I'm paying for all my tolls, all my fuel, all that, which you know that comes with being an owner operator. But, uh, this is what it is. I pay for it. Like, um, I come back home this week. Uh, I just started my week today. I'm going to be back on Monday to deliver my final load for the week. I got to go get, um, a DOT inspection and, um, an oil change. But, um, uh, it ain't no big deal. You got to do it. Uh, and as y'all know, y'all are going to see in this video. Uh, from the intro I just made. Uh, hopefully y'all like it. Give it a thumbs up if y'all like the new intro. If not, I'll change it up. I'm trying to make me a, a logo for my YouTube channel and for my trucks and stuff. So give me some time and that'll be pretty much going to be my um, intro and uh, for the videos. But there's just some pictures on my truck with a little bit of music. Um, but uh, I'm with Schneider. Um, it's an okay company. Goods and bads every company um do they pay as much as others no do they pay as little as others no you're getting a good okay middle ground probably not middle ground maybe a lower end of the middle ground but it's good money for the most part um so i mean if you decide to come to schneider uh comment below um and uh or um message me I might put my um, email in here or something in this video. Message me and uh, I'll get you set up with the recruiter I had. He's a good dude. He handled everything. Even um, when I got uh, in orientation, they lost their drug test. And we had to stay an extra week. They hand got a hold of him like that. He handled my hotel and all that. You know, no problem. No questions asked. He just did it. And I know a couple people in our classes, they're... 
recruiters didn't want to do that because they thought they was lying to them. It took them hours and hours and hours to get a hotel set up. My dude, he set it up within 15 minutes. So um, I put, I, I'll make an email or put an email down here for y'all to contact me. I'm going to get y'all set up with my recruiter. If y'all are owner-operators, if, uh, if y'all ain't owner-operators, <coughs> oh, I'm sorry. If y'all ain't owner-operators and y'all are looking to become owner-operators, you can also email me and uh, I will set you up with my uh, company I got my truck from. They are a little bit behind, but you can put a deposit down and it guarantee you a truck when it comes in. You get to pick your color. Uh, the brands that they sell are Freightliners, Volvos, Internationals. Uh, they the Peter. They do have Peterbilts and Kenworths, but them are they don't they ain't getting no new ones. So all those are going to be used trucks. Uh, and it's just you're waiting on somebody to turn one in kind of deal. So your best bet with this company, if this is the you know you want to go on this route. And you don't have a lot of money in your pocket, but you want to be an owner operator and have freedom. Do this. Yeah, um, do this route. It's, it's okay. You're gonna make money. You're gonna be happy. In my opinion, I am. I'm not you, so you know. But uh, I will put my contact information down there. Uh, you can email me, uh, and we'll talk about. The company I went through to get my truck, if y'all haven't heard of them, it's SFI. I can get you with my recruiter. It's not a recruiter, my sales rep uh, at SFI. He's a good dude. He hooked me up, uh, got me my truck. Took me like a month to get my truck. Some people, you know, it's taken three or four months. Just depends on the truck and brand you want. Um, but so far, I've had this International LTE 2022. I'm gonna put fifteen, almost fifteen thousand miles on it. Uh, haven't had a lick of problems with it so far. Knock on wood. But um, other than that, it's been a great truck. Uh, I know I've said it in the last couple of videos. I'm gonna do a truck review and reveal and all that. I will get to that. Um, right now, I've just been working. Uh, I'm gonna try to start building my YouTube channel more. Right now, I'm currently uh, recording this on my iPad. You know, I record stuff on my iPhone, too. Um, but other than that, it's been great. Uh, I know I showed you on the last video, I bought a dash cam. That thing, for $30, has been a champ. Uh, I mean, for $30, it, you can't beat it. It's on a recording loop cycle. After it gets so much video, it'll start deleting the oldest ones and, you know, recycling it. Uh, great, great camera so far. Um, but other than that, I think that's going to be it for this video. Um, but like I said, I'm currently with Snyder. I plan on staying with them for a while. I know um, there's better companies out there. Um, but right now, I'm going to stay with Snyder. I'm going to work it out here. I'm going to get my... my feet on the ground. I'm going to learn all I can and eventually I'm going to branch off. I'm not going to stay with Schneider forever. This is not my end goal to stay here forever. My end goal is to build a fleet of trucks or just get a couple trucks because I want to come off the road down the I want to come off the road out of the truck you know down the road you know I want to spend as much time with my kids as I can so I want to start making money investing my money and stuff buying more equipment uh, putting drivers in it, just keep it up. Uh, but other than that, that's going to be it for this video. Um, like, comment, subscribe. If you have any questions, I'm going to try to put an email down here. If I don't put an email down there, um, just comment and I'll get in contact with you. If you want to find out more about this, I'll give you the information I can. I'll set you up with my recruiter. Uh, I'll set you up with my sales rep at SFI if that's what y'all want. Um, but other than that, that's going to be it for this video. Hope y'all have a wonderful day and keep on trucking.